Okay, so the first thing you need to do uh, when you first get your wire is that you need to test your wire. And there's three main tests that you have to do. There's actually four if you have a mega ohm reader, but most of you are not gonna have one. So there's three required tests that you need to do three different times. So when before, once it's right on the roll, when you get it, after you're done with um, installing it into the Dieter heat mat, and then after you're done tiling and everything else. So there's three different times you have to test it, and there's three main tests that you have to do uh, that's required by Dietra. Okay, so once you get, I have two cables here, primarily because I'm doing a shower floor as well. So you always want to um, install a main cable on the outside floor and then do a separate cable just for the shower. And the main reason is, it's just, in case something happens to the wire, at least you have the main function in your bathroom working and the, and the shower can be done later. But that's what Schluter wants. If you're doing a shower, you have to use a separate cable. Okay. So the first test is just simply taking the two wires. This is a 120 volt system. And you just put one peg on one wire and one on the other. And then we got 16, 16.5. So 16.5 and it's supposed to be 15.6 just has to be within 10% of that reading. So we're fine on that. You can find the factory set ohm reading on the tags on the end of each Dieter heat wire. The second test, you just put it on this little buzzard and it just makes a sound. So just to test to make sure the buzzer's on, just connect these two wires. So that's on your buzzard. And then on that, you're just gonna test each cable. So your black wire to the ground. This is your ground. So you wanna test your ground to one of the cables. And then if you don't hear a buzzard, you're good. Same here on your white wire testing on your ground and your white wire and there's no buzzard so you're good okay so then this the third test you just want to be on the 20 okay on the 20k and then you want to take your your sensor wires okay then you just connect the two leads on your sensor As you can see, we have 11.42. So this is just a little temperature reader. And you wanna find out what the temperature is in your room. So on this one, right now, we're at 70.2 degrees. So note that. And don't forget to fill out the paperwork that came with each individual Dietra heat wire. All those numbers that we just went over, you want to put them in the warranty papers and do and send it into Schluter within 14 days. So I hope those quick references helped you out. In our next video, we're going to be showing you installing the actual wire in the shower and the outside floor. So click above for that next video. And there's some links down below that are helpful with uh, links for the multimeter and other things that are relevant to this project. So please subscribe and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks.